What is happening, everybody? Curdy B here, and welcome to part 15 of attempt number 3 on our Pokemon Platinum Redux Hardcore Mode, Hardcore Nuzlocke. In our last episode, we... What did we do last episode? We went to Iron Islands, we took on Fantina, we also beat our rival. We, <laughs> as our... Apparently, our claws in this, this um, Nuzlocke is... As soon as we get an encounter, we lose it in the same episode. So we managed to get that there. And we managed to get um, a Pokemon that has a very, very immature backwards spell on. But anyway, enough of that. In today's episode, we're going to go take on Baron, as you can see. And we're going to hopefully move on forward, get a few more encounters. And I think there's a lot of Team Galactic nonsense and boss fights we have to deal with as well. So, um, yep, we're going to continue on there. So, as usual, guys, if you're a regular viewer of the content and you're coming back, thank you very much for your support. I'm happy to have you, as long as you're happy to have me. If this is the first time you're watching any of my content and you're new to the channel, then I have to let you know that please be aware that I do like to swear. If you prefer PG, you may not like me, but if swearing's okay, then come on and let's play. So with all that fucking bollocks out of the road, let's get started. So what I've actually done here, off screen, controversial I know, I went through the, the gym because there's so many gym trainers now. And I really, really want to get this done as soon as possible. And I want to get the videos as short as I possibly can. So I'm not going to be you know, excluding every single fight when they're not random trainers. But I just thought, while I'm here, I'll get through the gym. So we had no casualties, thankfully. Well, we did over-level. I wanted to use Salamence in this fight. And it over-leveled slightly. So I had to make a substitution. But here's the team we're going to lead with for uh, Byron. So our lead is going to be Lemon 2, our camera up, holding the leftovers. With Thunderbolt, Teutonic Shift, Meteor Impact, and Stealth Rock. Got Rotarif, our Ferrothorn, holding the leftovers with Needle Arm, Twin Needle, Leech Seed, and Spikes. Ziplove, our Ninetales, holding the Choice Scarf with Overheat, Ice Burn, Will O Wisp, and Moonlight. A Tatar 2, our Raticate, who's quickly becoming a new MVP for us, uh, holding the Choice Ban with Crush Claw, Fin Attack, Punishment, and Quick Attack. The returning L Louis Quadnik 3, <laughs> Louis Quadnik 3 are uh, Typhlosion, holding the choice specs with Combustion, Napalm Strike, Fissure, and Gunk Shot. And finally, Moog Moog are Blossom, holding the leftovers with Giga Drain, Leech Seed, Weather Ball, and Synthesis. So, two possible teams. I'm not really fussed on either one. I'd rather have the one where there's only one Weather Setter with uh, one team as a Bastard on. I'd rather not have that one. But that's why I brought Moog anyway, but we'll see what we we'll get here. So, Byron! Yes, I defeated your son. He sucked ass. I mean, it's video too, by the way. You suck ass as well. You're in your fucking purple beard. Corviknight, so this is the Sandstream team. Um, okay, it's fine. So, Corviknight is where I leave with Lemon. So, I'm going to set up Stealth Rock. Awesome. So Agassi's down. This thing has fly. It has a move called, I think, mystical. What the fuck's it called? M mystical, mystical mist, which is like trick room for flying types. So it's fly, shadow crawl, and rusty swipes. So it wants to use shadow claw. So based on that, I'm gonna have a quick nip into Tatar two. And it'll go back into Lemon on the fly or the other rusty swipes. Okay, that actually makes us faster now, which is handy. So Thunderbolt, I'll get a free Thunderbolt off. Nice. Nice! Well, hold on here though. Now it's faster. And Trick Room is up. Okay, now this, this is fine. We'll Thunderbolt anyway. We'll stay in. Paralysis? Yay! How many turns was that?
Scissors in, okay. Trick room is still up, so many turns was that, so... Oh, fuck, I, need, I should have counted that, so... Three Thunderbolts. It should go off of the next turn, shouldn't it? It's five turns, isn't it? So, but it's the, 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 the turn it's used counts as one of the turns, so... We switched in, that was turn five, that was turn five. Thunderbolt turn four, Thunderbolt turn three, Thunderbolt turn two. Is there one turn left? Because if there's one turn left, I think the Quadnik is actually slower than Scizor. With 110 speed, Scizor has one, or actually one point slower, so in fact, yeah, I'm gonna go into you. If we're slower. Yeah, it didn't say it came back, so this is fine. Yep. More choice specs, your Aquaberry means shit all. There we go. Faster now. Does choice spec combustion kill this thing? I'm gonna have to cal. I never actually never. I, I planned on using Radicate here. It wants the earthquake, obviously. But if I can uh, combustion this thing, choice spec combustion after stealth rock. I'm gonna pause this and just calc this here. Get back. Okay, so it apparently annihilates Metagross, so yep, let's just do that. Yep. Okay. I gotta be too careful. It was definite, a definite one hit KO, so yeah, it's worked out very well then. Registeel. So, Registeel is electric and steel in this here, so I'm gonna go into Rotarif. It's fine. Now, I'm going to make a plan here, because what I've noticed, th this Registeel has super power, so for all intents and purposes, it should be using super power right now against the Steel type. But for whatever reason, and I, I noticed this with the, the Persian against Fantina, the AI is not keen on using moves that lowers its own stats unless it has to. Because whenever I was fighting that, with Rotary as well, whenever I was fighting that Persian, I was in there for a good solid, what, six, seven, eight turns? It never once used Punishment, which would have been its best move. So I'm going to see, we can, we can live a non-crit super power. I'm going to see what happens here. Yeah. It was absolutely fine. It's all it wants to discharge. I'm gonna set up one layer of spikes. Again, we should live a non crit super power here. And now I'm gonna switch into lemon two. Nope, not you, lemon two. Discharge. Or resist, it's back to full health. It has a shock of barrier, but this Teutonic Shift should kill it. Yep. Excellent. Bastion and next. Um It has sub zero slam. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm gonna go into what's left then. So I've got this. 
I've only got this and, and Drifling left. I'm going to go to Moog, get the sun set up. Okay. I'm going to go into the Love on the Draco Meteor, or Super Fang. It's fine. I'm going to overheat. That's fine. And even one more overheat to kill. Very good. And all that's left is Drift Blim. I have to straight swatch into a tad or two. Don't really care. To go for punishment? No, I'll do fin attack. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, I think we're still safe here. Just to be saving one in the lemon too, because we'll be faster under the, the trick room. There we go. Baron, you can suck my left one. Do that man badge, fool. Deathless Byron. I'll take that. TM91. Flash Cannon. The headset may also paralyze. Not anyone that can use that. Ferrothorn. Nah, your special attack's dog shit, so no. Let's heal everybody. Let's update our stats. So, six juicy badges, and our level cap is now, I believe, 61. The next fight, the next boss fight, is Saturn at Lake Valor. 61. So, I recall correctly, these fights are all pretty close to one another. But let's go ahead. Make our way across this bullshit. My road. I right, next time Saturn one level sixty one. The fuck do you want? Oh, I have to go through some bollocks there. Actually, let's. I'll skip this as well, because this is a story related box nobody cares about. Be right back. Okay, okay, so we went through all that story nonsense and we made our way to Lake Valor. So I think there's a few grunts here and then we fight Saturn, I believe it is. Saturn, it is, yes. So, Lake Valor. I think I'm getting an encounter here. I can't remember where, though. Can I avoid you. Can't avoid you though. Quick look at team who we have. There we go. This is our go to team for most shit. No, why the fuck would I want to flop around like a magic carpet in the mud? You absolute pullock. Fox or croak? Okay. That must be air slashing you, I think. Ow. That's not good. Um, I 
Put an ice punch on the zip loaf. And let's just safe overheat. Oh shit. I'm not really the best one for this job. Um Let's check your moves, Heracross. Don't betray me, Heracross. You're one of my favorite Pokemon of all time. I presume you have a fighting move, and that's why you've come in. Heracross, level 58. Yep. Heracross, level 58. Has. Guillotine. Dynamic Punch. So, yeah. Parasite and Poison Jab. So I resume what's the dynamic punch here. So if it's going to dynamic punch, I mean, yeah, Gemini is probably the best bet. Stay in though, so it's poison jab or guillotine now. So I was never want a guillotine, but does overheat kill? Like a burn it? No. Let's see. Woohoo! Zatu, let's straight into Tata, I think. No, no, hold on the fuck. I've done this before. You'll have some bullshit move like Counter Strike or some nonsense. Zatu. I'm doing this for every single Pokemon I don't know. L59, so it has nasty plot, aeroblast, mind crush, and hypnosis. No, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Don't use hypnosis, please. That's fine. Because we're faster and kill you if you attack. Excellent. That dick Ronco was down. Fuck you, mate. Uh, I can go up there. Grunt is here. Do, 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 do. The Galactic Bomb. Okay, Don Fan. So I presume you want to use a rock move, so I'm going to repu for you. That's fine. I think I'll do a counter strat here. I think I'll go back into a gem there then. Oh no, wait. Yeah. I'm gonna air slash you to death. I'll just wait on a quick claw coming up there. B drill! You wouldn't have anything that would do major damage to me. Let's have a look. 59 B drill. Take off, needle arm, toxic spikes. No, you've nothing there. This was air slash. It's fine, you do that. It's fine. Ursa ring. So you. Mm, what do you have? Ursa ring. Level 58.
double edge, outrage, repair, tighten jaws. So I'm going to presume you want to double edge. In that case, it's going to rotary. That's a lot of damage. Now, because super power drops stats, doesn't want to use that. Did I chance this? Did? Ah, yes. No, I just want a super power. A Gemini dies if it switches into a double edge. Might do lemon here. Ideal. Revolt. Even more ideal. Yes. Those two powers were so lucky. Dragalgi. I reckon I'll check your moves. This would be Rapu. It has a water move. What am I doing here? Dragology. Dragology, level fifty eight Dragalgi. Roar of Time, Toxic Spikes, String Shot and Sludge Rolls, it has no water moves. It's got Dragon move, Bug move, and Poison move. So I presume wants to use the Dragon move here, if that's the case I'm going to zip love. Mm -hmm. There's Ice Burn here. I'm not risking a miss here. I'm not risking a miss. Oh, ooh, I was lucky. Woohoo! And I think it's a cave here. Yep, one more grunt to deal with. Saturn, no 61, Mars, 63. Dee dee dee, fuck you, grunt, I'll punish you. Punish me, I work away. You trap, big lad. Your fucking haircut. Agron. I am not risking that shit. I'm going to go into. Wonder Rapu. Wonder Rapu, yeah. Earthquake. Then I'm one hit KO. Okay. Oh shit. Lucky uh, Rapu's defense was all fuck. Scun tank. Hmm. Poison normal, if I recall correctly. They try counter strat here. 
the earthquake. Shut a counter. Hang on, there. We'll reef you. Now, I know you have a tendency to have fire moves. So let's just see here. What level are you? 60? Woo! Okay. 6 0, big cheese. Punishment. Double edge point now, nah, we're fine. And I probably won't, even, won't want to use punishment anyway. So I think I'm happy enough to lead seed. Fuck off. What's a fighting move? We'll use that again. I'm going into a gem there. Of course it didn't use it again, why would it? Uh, Lemon makes a safe bet here. Yay! Gotta love static. Between... We have, um... I just realized Ferrothorn has... Effects more, and this has static. We have lots of these different... 30% chance contact, shite, it's great. Fuck, there's another one? Fuck. My boy's evolution, no! Uh, ooh, fuck. I got to stay in here and just tonic shift. Yes! Levin comes through the clutch crit. Yo, suck on that. Right, I'm gonna say Craft 4 went to this cave for the fight with uh, Saturn, so I'll be right back. Alrighty, so we have our team crafted and ready to rock and roll for the two possible Saturn fights. But here's our superstars. Our leader is gonna be Eltrix 3, our starter Blastoise. Own the wise glasses, and the reason we have wise glasses is because one of the possible teams has a probo pass, and without the wise glass, well, sorry, with the wise glasses, flash cannon is a two hit KO. Without them, it's not, and we need that uh, to be the case. So, yep, here we go with Stealth Rock, Surf, Agent Power, and Flash Cannon. Zip Love, our Nine Tails, holding that choice scarf with Overheat, Ice Burn, Will O Wisp, and Moonlight. Sue Lewis, Lewis, <laughs> our brand, our hard, our hard dragon. I don't think we've used you yet. Uh, holding the choice scarf with Umbreal Arrival, Dragon Pulse, U Turn, and Arrow Blast. You're being pretty much here because you have Levitate. Rotarif, our Ferrothorn, holding the leftovers with Rusty Swipes, Rapid Spin, Leech Seed, and Spikes. We have Rusty Swipes because it's the more, it's the better used move against some of the Pokemon in this uh, fight. Rapu, our Quagsar, hold of the leftovers with Aqua Tail, Counter, Earthquake, and Yawn. And Lemon 2, our Camerot, hold the leftovers as well with Thunderbolt, Tectonic Shift, Meteor Impact, and Stealth Rock. So I prefer the Togekiss um, team, not the Probopass one, because the Probopass team has a Zatu with uh, Citrus Berry, can't, that Magic Guard, and it's very scary. Or sorry, Salak Berry, it's very scary. So. Fuck you, boomerang head. Yes, Togekiss team. So, for the Togekiss team, I'm going to throw up Stealth Rocks first. That's fine, don't really care about that. I'm going to get off an Ancient Power. Now, just in case I get crit, I'm going to go into Suolois. So, Suolois. And we're gonna. This has to hit for the kill. Lovely. 
We reflect this up, but we're gonna uh, to, to get around that. Shuckling Nick Silver Shuckle. Our strategy is into Road to Reef. That's fine. We're going to Lead Seed. That's lovely. Gonna set up one layer of spikes. And now we're gonna go into Rapu, who with the Elite Seed will bring it down to half, and then we should be able to kill the Earthquake. Shuggle is poison rock in this game. This should kill. Lovely. Jump loaf and next. So for jump loaf, you go straight into zip loaf on the grass move. I mean, it's overheat. Overheat is a one shot. We're risking ice burn as it has a Yachi berry as well. Cross the next, so Crossel wants to probably use Rock Wrecker or um, Crab Hammer. Probably Rock Wrecker, so we're going to go into Repo for this. And I'm going to counter. Lovely. Vessel Queen in next, South Rock takes down the half. Give me switching the zip loaf, and we overheat. That should kill. Who's left now? I'm oh, okay. So down to half health talent feeling, so we need to switch to do a bit of a switch around here, so. Into Lemon 2, Fish for Static. Lovely jubbly. God, I love Static. It's popping off for us very well. And Thunderbolt for the kill. Oh, lovely. Is it really nice when fights go your way? Saturn, you can suck my left one. Let's heal everybody. Right, did I get an encounter here? Or is there grass somewhere? I know there's definitely a Lake Ferdy encounter. Oh, sorry, Lake Fowler encounter. Is it up there? I can't get, can I get there yet? Or is that space that was blocked now I can go? How do I get the, the Lake Val Lake Barry Valor encounter then? Is it in the cave? There's guys up there, but I can't get up there. This is Valor Cavern, so there's no encounter here. Let's see. Did not only get to the, the encounters in so Lake Verity is my next encounter, so I can't, I can't get one here. It's okay. I 
Don't I go to like very night, don't I? I think one of these grunts said that's where they're going. Is it you? No, was, there's another one up here. Oh, there was one up here. Anyway, this will fly off to Lake, Lake Verity. Be right back. Okay, we're at Lake Verity here, so there's a double battle. Uh, we'll, uh, what I think I'll do, because we're on a bit uh, lo um, low, we're on a bit um, long here, I don't want to go massively overboard. I'll do this double battle, get my encounter, and then I think I'll leave the next, um, what's the next fight in Mars for the, the, the next um, the, uh, episode, but let's go through this double battle first. Fun! Double battles are always lots of fun. Okay. So, oh, Earth slash Toxicro. And Overheat Toxicro as well. It's fine. I would rather get there's only one Pokemon left on that side. Ooh. What do you have, Inferno Pod? I know you're quite slow. Level 61 Inferno Pod. Bug Buzz, Tail Glow, Fisher, and Super Power. Actually, no fire moves, so I can stay in with a Gemini then. Air Slash. I stay with both. No, I'm not going to stay with both because Simple Love might die. I'm going to Air Slash. And. He just tries a super power. I'm gonna go into repo here. Fuck. I'll do nothing to me. Very good. So, unless this happens again. I'm going to Aqua Tail the Spur too. Very good. So I got one on one, so I'm going to. You no, can't have this on the stand, do it? Air Slash. In with a Tatar. Oh! I think I'm fine. I'm fine. Stand here, yeah, and crush claw. Yeah. Not taking the risk. <laughs> Is that what we're doing? Another focus sash thing? Fuck off. This should be an ki easy kill. There we go. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Right. Lake Verity encounter. I don't want to fight that grunt just yet. And there's Mars. I'll lead off with 
the root teeth. So it looks very neat. Ooh. A fighting type. Bug fighting. One of my favorite typings. It's not a hair cross, but. I can make it work. What's your moves right now? Median. X, Scissor, Sky Uppercut, Dizzy Punch and Sucker Punch. Bug, fighting, normal, dark. Mm. Who's the best option here? Fuck. It's fine. Um. Yep, not touching you again. Start throwing balls. Need to buy more dust balls. Yes, we got Lydian! Bug fighting. So another fighting type, which we don't really have. Another bug type. Yep, let's have a look. L-E-D-I-N Nidel Nidel and Eddie and welcome to the team buddy let's have a, a vitreous at you I you get Iron Fist Eddie and bug fighting Ooh yes That's sexy Ooh Ooh Iron Fist it's got 162 speed and 155 attack. Mm. All the punches. Mm. You get me excited, that in. Look at that attack. Look at that speed. Look at that special defense. Look at that dog shit special attack we don't give a fuck about. What are your stats? You must have awesome stats. Ladian. Ready, my boy. 108 attack, 123 speed. Base that somewhere a total of 543. Iron Fist. Yes. Whisper it quietly. This might be a uh, Pokemon that we're going to use. Oh, we're not going to use now. We're going to stop the curse of the Pokemon being killed in the episode. That's why I'm going to end the episode now. It can die next episode. That's fine. I don't care about that. It's not, I'm not letting it die this episode. So I think we'll leave it there, guys. Uh, we will take on Mars and I think it's Jupiter after her. I think. Where's my boss fights? Well, it's just Mars. So we have Mars and then I think we make our way to the snow point where we fight, I think, a wild Maylene. And then we take on Candace for the, uh, the seventh gym badge. But we'll leave it for now. So as you know guys, thank you much for watching, hope you've been entertained watching this my lovely, wonderful content. Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. If you're a content creator yourself, subscribe to the channel, I'll subscribe back to you. Let's grow our communities together. With that being said, take it easy, all the best, and good luck. See you later, bye.